Now, if you want your child to study in the new school building with all facilities, pay up to 250% more than the existing fees. That's what the management of Mumbai school Garodia International Center for Learning has allegedly told parents of existing students. Parents are now knocking on every door to prevent this alleged extortion from the school side. My colleague Ashwarya Paliwal was there at the school and she gets us this report. Take a look. If you want your kids to have better education, be in a school that has good infrastructure and good quality of teachers, then be ready to cough up 250% more than the fee that you were paying in the old school. Well, that's what the management of Garodia International has been telling the parents of those children who have been studying in the old building, which is right behind me. Now, for first standard, parents of those children who were studying here used to pay 1,50,000 rupees. If they want to shift the child from the old building into the new one, they will have to cough up 5,75,000, which is almost a 262% hike in the basic fees. Now, when we got in touch with management, they told us that this hike is only due to better infrastructure, better quality of teachers and better quality of education overall. What parents, on the other hand, are saying that shouldn't this be a gradual process? If you're shifting uh, from one school to the other one, if you're shifting from the old building to the new one, then why do we need to pay so much more, almost 260% more than the existing fees? Parents are saying that they were promised good infrastructure for the past 10 years when the children were studying in this school. That promise was never fulfilled. And now the management is saying that because they are coming up with a new building, the parents must pay. Though the management says that it's optional for the parents to either shift to the new one or stay in the old building, parents are saying it's the right of the child to have better education. And if the child has been studying here in this institute for the past 10 years, then shouldn't this be a gradual process? Ashwara Paliwal for Mirror Now. He has promised us uh, before that, you know, when, uh, um, when uh, international school is there, uh, new building is going to come up. We, we, he will transfer every, each and every student from this old building to the new building. But now he is asking uh, to take out the admission from the new old school and again take admission in the new school with fee hike of 260%. School management has also involved the kids in it. There is also a big canvassing which was done with the kids in the school mentally disturbing them, telling them that if your parents love you, ask them to take admission in the new school. And this all is happening during when the examinations is on. Year on year, we've been uh, facing our 10 to 15 percent hike, nothing less than that. And uh, definitely we are not satisfied with the increase because there is no infrastructure we have been given that we had been promised. Instead of naturally shifting all the children there and fulfilling his promise, what he has done is he's positioning the new, that premise as a brand new school. Mirror now reached out to the management of the Garodia International School for a response. The management sent us an email response and I quote, Garodia International Center for Learning is a new institution instituted by the Garodia Education Trust. This is completely different from the other school run by the trust. Parents of students from the existing school have been given the option of taking admission in the new facility and as an incentive to the move have been offered a 30% discount off on the fees for the new school. The parents, however, can, can choose to continue with the existing school as well. The existing school will continue to function as long as there are students in their classrooms. However, no new admissions to any grades will be accepted in the existing school. The proposed fee hike that you have referred to is for the existing school where the school has over the past four years passed on an inflationary increment onto the parents to the tune of approximately 9% per annum. There has been no increment approved for the upcoming year which the management will have a discussion with the PTA." Unquote.